Now, a little bit of advice for the school teachers. Listen to me. Start showing your students some respect. We are not interested in knowing what you think about sex or gender. We will make up our own minds about that by using critical thinking. We don't need to know what you think. I definitely do not need you ramming your opinions down our throats. So please keep these things to yourselves. We don't want to know. With that said, let's now get back to talking about mathematics, English and science. We go to school to learn these things. We do not go to school to learn about sex. We the people, we must get these tyrants out of our government. These tyrants find it impossible to leave us all alone to get on with our own lives. It's one disaster after another with these disgusting tyrants. And we don't want them. Any church, any bishop or archbishop, priest, vicar, whether in Canterbury, Coventry or anywhere else in the UK who remains in support of this evil transgender propaganda, you have also been deceived and have fallen for Satan's deception. And to those I say this, live in accordance with the word of God Come or on. leave the church now. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. 100%. Any, any bank that closes the account of another person because they don't hold the same political views as them. People, draw out your money from these banks and close your accounts. The Yorkshire Bank is one of these financial organisations. What business is it of the banks what our individual opinions are? Okay, I'm sorry, but my 10 minutes are up now, and I've been told to keep it to 10 minutes. So please listen out for part two of the transgender speech, which I'll be revealing in Leicester on the 12th of August.